Hi friends, welcome to the IT. My name is Vatan. Guys, we are discussing number system, right? Uh, previous classes we done the prime number, Fibonacci series, Armstrong number, strong number, perfect number. You please check that videos if you need. Okay, this video we will discuss about the palindrome number. Palindrome, palindrome number, right? Yeah, palindrome number is very simple thing, right? What the palindrome number tell me? The palindrome number means what? If we take the number, uh, give your number, right? If you take the number is like, you know, 1 to 121. Just take the number 121. If you reverse that number, we should get the same number, right? Because given number is, uh, given number is what? 121. And even reverse number also much more. Uh, reverse number also what? 121, right? That is called palindrome number. Guess you got the point, right? What is the, what is the palindrome number? So given number and reverse number, both are same, then that should be the palindrome number, right? That should be what? Palindrome number, palindrome number right? Exactly. Okay, it's very simple. Just we can uh, take the data. In the data, uh, take the last digit. Guys, the code is very simple, right? What the code tell me here? The step one. Take the input from end user. Take the input from, uh, take the input from what? Uh, end user, right? First one. And the second one, take the input from end user using scanner class right exactly yes next one take the while loop right take the while loop take the while loop check the just you can uh, uh, take the while loop right yeah for example take the yeah take the while loop case okay, so in while loop just you can check the number not equal to zero up to you how to repeat up to zero right yeah okay just we can reverse the number right how do you, how can you reverse the number tell me here to reverse the number take the last number get the last number guys get the what get the last number right get the last digit how can you get the last digit tell me here to get the last digit number mod uh, number uh, modular 10 right guys get the last digit guys get the last digit uh, store into the reverse variable guys store into what reverse variable right exactly guys get the last digit store into the reverse variable guys get the last digit store into what uh, store into reverse variable right after storing into reverse variable and remove the last digit right because we got the last digit to store into the reverse variable remove the digit and again take the last digit to store into reverse variable remove it again last the last digit to store into reverse variable store into what reverse variable and you can delete it right exactly guys remove the number how can you remove the number tell me here number i think by 10 right exactly guys the above process is repeated for all numbers right the above process is repeated tell me the above process is the above process is what uh, repeated for how many numbers guys here repeated for all numbers right exactly repeated for all digits better you can write the digits right that's it guys that is called palindrome okay check the third point what third point tell me here so given number and mm, given number under reverse number okay reverse number reverse number both are same means what no? palindrome both are not same yes, given number and reverse number both are hmm, both are same both are same means palindrome so palindrome otherwise not right otherwise not okay that is information guys but clear huh? so just to take the input from end user take the while loop get the last digit store into reverse variable and get the second digit store into reverse variable remove the second digit get the third digit store into reverse variable remove the third digit right guys the logics are very simple guys just we need to focus bit that's all what we have to do if you know that requirement simply we can do the requirement right exactly guys check the code here tell me guys how can you take the input from end user require the scanner class scanner s equal what new scanner and you can take the system dot what in right exactly guys scanner s equal new scanner or system dot in and the system dot how to dot printl enough eclipse id means writing the code simple there but here every word we should type right system dot how to dot printl enough enter your number uh, to check palindrome enter your number okay to check the uh, palindrome right to check the palindrome palin yeah pa palindrome right exactly okay so you will enter the number take that number scanner dot whatever next thing you can take the data then you can take the into what number right that is a number guys that's all 
guys after that this is a step one guys what is step one here uh, take the number from take the number from what end user right that is a code and we should import one class like you know scanner class right because the scanner class belongs to util package java dot util dot what a scanner class after reading the data we need to close the scanner class s dot what close right that is a data reading process guys exactly guys next step is what am i take the take the while loop read every digit store in a reverse variable right read take the while uh, take the while loop uh, read every digit read every uh, digit uh, store into which variable guys here reverse variable right store into reverse variable okay check the while loop guys while uh, check the while loop if number up to zero we have to repeat if number not equal to zero okay see in all the classes like in all the examples i written number not equal to zero okay number not equal to zero assume like he entered one to one he entered like you know one to one uh, he entered like you know one to one right when he enter the one to one get that uh, first last digit how do you get the last digit tell me here int digit equal to tell me int digit equal to, int digit equal to tell me number uh, modular 10 right number modular 10 means it returns the last digit that last digit we need to store into reverse variable that's what here you can take the int reverse equal to initially zero initially reverse is what zero right that's what guys then you can take the uh, reverse equal to reverse uh, star 10 hmm, plus what am I digit okay see to you want to add the data right in the reverse number to add the data guess to add the data we can go for the star 10 guess modular 10 to get the last digit um, star 10 to add the digit into last by 10 remove the last digit guys don't forget these three points if you remember the three points star 10 star 10 uh, add the data at last add the data um, add the data at the last guys add the data at what last right so modular 10 modular 10 means what am I? get the last digit get the last digit next one is what by 10 by 10 means what am I? remove the last digit right exactly remember that when you want to add the data just you can make that uh, number with the 10 right exactly but first case uh, what the number you got tell me one you got the one digit is one then reverse is initial i take in the zero zero into ten zero then you'll get the one plus one right okay now reverse is how much more reverse is one when the second uh, digit is taken two then tell me previously which is like you know reverse is one one into ten 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 plus two twelve right guys ten plus two what twelve or not like that the data will be repeated guys because you got a point right this is like you know get the last digit and this is like you no know, store into reverse variable and remove the last digit okay this is what get the last digit right get the last digit uh, store into what variable guys here a uh, reverse variable right reverse variable and remove the last digit right how can I remove number equal to number by 10 right okay this is a code what remove the last digit right guys remove the last digit that's all get the last digit store into reverse variable remove the last digit right the loop is repeated for all the data then at last you will get the reverse number right exactly okay check the given number and reverse number right check the given number and uh, what number guys tell me here given number and what reverse number right exactly guys tell me how to check the given number and reverse number to check the given number and reverse number i think when the loop is repeated number becomes a zero right at last that's what guys here you can take the int temporary variable equal to what number at last i am checking the if condition if uh, temp double equal to tell me guys temp double equal to what reverse right yeah temp double equal to reverse if temp double equal to reverse then print the message the system dot out dot printer enough tell me guys system dot out dot printer enough mm, what the message your number is your number is what palindrome right guys your number is what palindrome that's all else block Guess temporary variable means number only right your number which is double equal to reverse both are same both are same means that is called which number guess palindrome number right guess yes or no yeah that is called palindrome number guys you can write the else block in else block what the message you can write just you can copy this code your number is palindrome or not palindrome not palindrome right okay that is a code that's all just we can go for the step by step process take the number from end user 
Take the while loop, read every digit, get the last digit, store into reverse variable, remove the last digit. Get the last digit, store into reverse variable, remove the last digit, right? Guys, yes or no? Exactly. Okay, simply can save this code. In local disk D, I'm going to save this code. Local disk D, the file is what? Java file, right? Just open the command prompt, local disk D. Local disk what? D. Yeah, how to compile the code, guys? Java's the application is what? Test.java. Okay, fine. I, I take in the test.java, guys, but you please make the variable X class name is what? Palindrome example. Guys, just you can take the variable name is what? Palindrome example, right? Exactly. Guys, now let me write the class is what? Test class, right? Exactly. Guys, 1 to 1. 1 to 1 is a palindrome or not? Yes. Guys, check this one. Your number is palindrome or not? Guys, your number is what? Palindrome, right? Exactly. Guys, we have the multiple palindrome numbers. Triple one, palindrome, right? Guys, double nine, palindrome, right? Okay, sir, no. And you can write the two not two. Two not two is a palindrome, right? These are the palindrome numbers, guys. Your number is palindrome. Your number is palindrome. Your number is what? Palindrome, right? Exactly. Okay, so clear. So if you enter some numbers which is not palindrome, uh, I enter like this, right? This is as a not palindrome. If you enter the number like this, this is also not palindrome. If you enter the two, four, double, three, this is also not palindrome, right? Exactly. Guys, are you clear? That is called palindrome number, guys. Guys, we should have the analysis. That's it. Most of the students are like, you know, uh, like struggling to make the palindrome number, to check the number is palindrome. Just to get the every digit, uh, last, get the last digit, store into reverse variable, right? To make the reverse value into 10, we have to. Guys, to store the data into 10, right? Reverse equal reverse into 10. Modular 10 means get the last digit. Star 10 means add the digit. By 10 means remove the digit, right? Exactly. Guys, are you clear, right? That is called palindrome number, guys. There are three points you need to check. Guys, all of you like the video, comment the video, subscribe to our channel to get the more videos. Guys, please write down these notes here so that you get the more clarity. Don't waste the time and, and focus on these all the numbers. So we discussed all the numbers, right? Yeah, you focus on these all the numbers, guys. Hmm? Thank you, guys. Like the video, comment the video, subscribe to our channel to get the more videos. Bye.